Hi guys, thank you for stopping by to share with Julie today. I hope you are having a fantabulous day today. In this video, I am looking at a condition that is called leukorrhea, which is really a discharge, a whitish or a yellowish discharge from the vagina. This is often due to inflammation of the mucous membrane when the womb is infected and this often signifies that the system is in a toxic state. There are a number of herbs that can be used to address this. They are sometimes used individually and sometimes in formula. And these include beth root, crane's bill, myrrh, yarrow, oak bark, horse tail, ladies mantle, raspberry leaves, dead nettle, horse tail, white pond lily, and mountain grape among others. Herbs can be used to make teas, for example, combining ladies mantle with raspberry leaves to make a tea which could be had daily. Also capsules and tablets can be made with herbs and of course herbal formulas can be made to use as a vaginal douche. Raspberry leaves is often used for this also or stale and of course other herbs like the yarrow can be used to make a douche or the tea can be made and a tampon can be soaked and that can be inserted in the vagina and worn for a period of time. This is something that many women would have had to deal with at various points in their lives, having some form of vaginal discharge, especially the whitish or yellowish, yellowish discharge. And so what we know is that this signifies a toxicity of the system, and so it is not just important to use the herbs to bring about um, improvement but to also change the diet and so individuals who have this who are experiencing this and it can be really frustrating especially when there is foul odor that is coming from the vagina as a result of this and it is reassuring to know though that the diet can play a part and I would advise anyone who is dealing with this to also change the diet. Go for a period, um, hopefully long term, but even for a period of time in the short term, um, set yourself a schedule of maybe um, two months, three months where you would have a diet of primarily fruits and vegetables or that should be the majority of what you consume along with of course using the herbs to bring about change. Anyway guys I hope you found this useful. Subscribe to my channel, like and share my videos. Don't forget be the change you'd like to see in this world. Have a fantabulous day today. Ta-ta!